welcome to On the Road with Roger. Today we're on the way to my office where we're going to have a free class on Hanging Art 101. Today we're going to give you a step-by-step -step on how to hang that masterpiece that you have. Many things to consider when hanging a piece of art. For example, how tall are your ceilings? What's the layout of the room? How large is the room? There are some general rules to follow for how high or how big the art should be when you're considering where it should go. You want to try to fill as much space on the wall as possible depending upon the furniture arrangement. For example, if you're hanging a piece of art above the couch, you want to put the bottom of the frame approximately six to eight inches above the back of the couch. For class today, we're hanging art in the office. Art should be at eye level. What does that mean? Get ready to take notes. First thing you want to do is measure the height of your art piece and divide it by two. In our case, the piece is 18 inches, so nine is our halfway mark. The next thing you want to do is to take the center of the stretched back of the art to the top of the frame, and for our consideration, it is four inches. The third step is to subtract your number from the second measurement from your first measurement. So in our case, four inches from nine is five. The standard for most eye level art pieces at a museum are 57 inches plus the number that you've just come up with. So in our case, 57 plus 5 will be the measurement of where we're going to put the hook on the wall for the art piece. Mark your measurement in pencil on the wall. 62. It's always nice to use a picture hanger with a hook than just a nail to secure your piece of art. Then you enjoy your masterpiece. Thanks for coming to class today with Roger. If you have any questions about hanging art or other questions about real estate, I look forward to hearing from you.